Hello everybody, I'm the Wonder Man and welcome back to Minecraft FCB Continuum. Uh, last episode I made the EFAB crafting grid and some of the components to make uh, iron tools. So I made the iron pickaxe, which was yeah, all this stuff is, is needed to make simple iron tools can't do it in the crafting table just can't just look at this i have to do it like all this stuff so yeah made that last episode so this episode we're going to continue with the questing book and continue forward so uh the military why why and tinkering quests is the the tasks at hand so let's look at this this military is a multi-block that allows you to make alloys make metal tool parts and gears at the cost of lava as fuel so if you've played with tinker's construct before you know what this is uh, so we just have to make all the uh smeltery things uh Yes. Right. Also just start with the wooden crafting things. Now that the EFAP is set up, we can get started with Tinker's construct. While you technically only need six blank patterns to make all the blocks and functioning uh, pickaxe, you should make a few more. Get that. So yeah. Tool station, part builder, stencil table, and a blank pattern. Okay, so let's start out with this. So let's start with a blank pattern. That's just a single piece of wood in the ear. That's actually pretty easy. So like that maybe. I'll make a few of these. So is that different? Wait, what? Is that? Oh, you need creosote oil for that. Okay, fair enough. I'll just. I'll just take some time. All right. Fifteen seconds. Yes, we have one. Oh, this is um. Yeah, this can be cool. I haven't done a lot since last. I've only been mining for like ten minutes, twenty minutes. There's, there's not really much that has been uh, added. I haven't really gotten much more stuff since last time. I might be doing some uh, mining between episodes just because nobody wants to see mining. Oh, that time the sound didn't play. So, yeah, there's my mine shaft. Down to level 15. And I think it goes down to 15. Is the sound just broken now? What is this? Oh yeah. So, we'll just have a look. It has detected that, yes. So we need a stencil table, a part builder and a tool, st tool stuff, tool station. Uh, stencil table that's easy wait do i oh, i can just make that in a crafting bench okay so i do this and that stencil table there okay cool stencil table right uh the part builder is next uh part 
builder. That's just a wooden lock and a stencil. There you go. Bad builder. And that should have... Yes. And then we need the tool station. That's a crafting table with a blank tool station. There we go. So now I should have all the things. What was... Ah, yeah, the quest. Tinkering has been completed. So let's claim our reward. And that, so we're done. Oh. Did you know we had all excavation? I'll take a look at that. Uh, on the chest. Using the excavate modifier, you can mine out entire veins just by mining one block from it. At lower levels, the tool will only have a chance to break a single extra ore touching the ore you mine. As you increase the level of the modifier, it will have a larger chance of successfully mining the other ore, uh, the other blocks, as well as starting to mine larger veins. Increasing the level of the modifier does not use more modifier slots, it will only ever use one. You can only mine ores and clay with a modifier. It will be useless on anything else. This will also uh, this is also available as an enchantment for other tools. Cool. Excavate modifier, so excavate. Oh. Yeah, okay, that's just... Sure. I'll just make that. Oh, it's night time. Damn it. Okay, I'll, I'll take a quick look on the other quest, the military. So we need... Smeltery uh, drain, faucet, casting table, seal tank, and smeltery controller, and a lot of these bricks. So, how do we make all this seared brick? Seared stone brick? Ah. Uh, seared brick. Get that from seared stuff we get from grout. Grout is made from clay blocks, gravel and sand. So let's get out our flint and we'll hold on a second, make some shovels because we'll need that. So one, two, um, bum. There we go. So I'll go get a lightning arrow. Oh, I'll go get some clay. I know there's some clay down in the mine shaft. I think it is lightning. Oh yeah, and gravel. And gravel. I need gravel, not flint. Thank you. Oh, that's not. That's some stone and fix the steps like that yes da, da, da. so there was some clay when I would dig down yeah now yeah, right here that's clay I don't know what mud does this but it's here that's fine so, and this is down where I mine at level 15. There are some holes. I don't want to dig them out yet, but yeah, there's some, some interesting stuff. I 
found this uranium. I don't know if I, if I should mine it yet. Because there might be radiation and other stuff linked with that stuff. That's not something I want to deal with right now. So, yes. I'll get the necessary resources to make uh, all this this grout stuff. I am grout. And yes, I'll be back when I have a decent amount. So I finally returned to my little hobby hole and I got all my uh, my things. Also got some some small amounts of food because uh yeah I happened to die once. Uh I'm not very proud of that, but that kind of thing happens. Uh I I, I need to get some food. Oh, this is food stuff. Okay. I'll get this. Wow, that's a bunch of food stuff. Peas, spinach, celery, oats, rye, cabbage, broccoli, raspberry, rutabach. I don't know how to say that. Holy flour. All right. So we'll just dump all these food stuffs and other like that in. Here. I'll drop that there. And oh, that's a sorting thingy. So yes, we are making grout. And I do that in crafting. Fantastic. Uh, so. Routes. I'll go on the table. So we need clay blocks. I'll make eight for now. We'll see how much that makes. And that's 32 grout. I probably need more. I'll make more. I made more. There you go, 64. Kraut. So I'll do that. That's gonna take some time. And I'll make another furnace, just to speed it up a bit. In the meantime, while this is cooking, I, uh... I spotted some sheep over in that direction. Oh, monsters. I'll get some of my food. Uh, but I spotted some sheep. And uh, I, I want to make a bed. Just because... Uh, I don't want to die and walk all the way again. So, how do we make a shear? Yeah. Oh, I can do that in the crafting table. Fantastic. Okay, so this is cooking. I'll go grab some wool for a bed. I need the food. Where's the sheep? 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 I need the sheep. There's the sheep. Yoink. That's one. Give me two. Give me two. Yes. 
Oh, that's uh, actually. Well, I'll take some extra wool with me. Uh, I'm out. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, go back, go back, go back. There you go. Ew. Only slightly tense. Bed. I can do that on a crafting table too. Fantastic. Do that there. No. And, that. and I'll I'll dig this wall out. Oh appetite. Cool. Oh, and copper. Cool, cool. So I'll, I'll plunk down my bed there. And... Sweet dreams. Nice. So I set my spawn point and... Turned it to day. Fantastic. This is still going. So... Yeah. Uh, I can do some crafting with this. So we need a controller. Smeltery controller. That's just... Takes 10 minutes. Alright, fair enough. So the only thing I make in the EFAP, that's the controller. Alright, fair enough. I'll just do that and start crafting. Takes 10 minutes. Oh boy. Uh, yes, so what I do now is I make the tank. I don't have any sand on me. I'll get a piece of sand real quick. Just a single piece of sand, I don't mind. That's a witch. Ooh. Wait. Well, oh, I'm bad at math. Yes. Uh, I'll take that. Just do that real quick. I only need to make like that much. There we go. So I make a tank like so and what else see a tank right that's that one right yes i need 18 bricks a smeltery drain a faucet and a casting table uh, drain is like this a faucet is like that a casting table is like that this is just me remembering from previous experiences so now i need the 18 bricks how much do i get per oh i need to make more and I, I need to make more I, I just do this and uh, do that, yes. 
And uh Yes I guess I'll be back when this is done in seven minutes. Uh, okay, so there's still some time left on this crafting and this is almost done. But I just, I noticed when I looked in here, I, I completely didn't recognize that this was open quests I could do. So, yeah, there's a questing tutorial. Flashing red quests are unlocked and you can click on them to see how to complete them. Complete the quests flash blue if they have a reward that hasn't been collected. Good to know. And green if they don't. Uh, Grey quests have not been unlocked, it cannot be completed. You can, however, uh, you can, there, you can hover over locked to see what uh, quests they require to be completed to unlock them. Cool stuff. Uh, quest lines, blah blah blah. Yes. So I have to do this, and that's that. This quest is for when the mod pack updates, and you will update the quests and rewards. Ah, so not now. Uh, workstation, workshop table. The workshop table has four slots for either crafting tables, furnaces, which means you can use them all at the same time in the upgrades tab. You can set which quarter has the furnace or crafting table items stay inside the workshop table when you close it. You can apply a single storage upgrade to each crafting table slot. You may need six items for it to use when this crafting storage upgrade installed. Items will be pulled out of the six slot instead of the crafting grid. Cool. So, a workshop table. Yes, yeah, I'll take a look at that. Workshop. Workshop table. Blank upgrade, cobblestone and stuff, and oh, I can make that. Uh, I'll I'll have a look at that in the next episode. There we go, the smeltery controller. So if I go back and into the things, yes, smeltery controller, and now I just need the bricks. So I do this now, and like so. Uh, I'll just make a chest real quick, just to keep this stuff. Uh, yes, so yeah, I have cleared out this little area so we can have all the things here. So I'll put the stencil table there, heart builder, tool station, and the chest. And I'll put down, wait, I have to, yes, this quest is complete, so I claim this. There we go. Boom. It doesn't say anything. Alright. Fair enough. So I make... I'll make a... I'll make a 2x2, two two, I think. Yeah, I think that's how I do it. I put that... There. Just because, and I'll put the controller here, and the tank, 
I'll put that there. And that should be that. Yes, this lights up. That means it's working. Yes. So, yep. We have that. I'll take the faucet. And I'll put it there. And the casting table and put it beneath. So when things pour out of it, it'll get in the casting table. Right. And all we need now is lava for fuel. I consume the can it's fine and yeah that should be that i have some iron i want to melt but i want to how would i do that from the casting table i need a cast iron thing i'm above Molten gold, molten brass, aluminum brass. Can I? I haven't seen any gold. Oh, uh, wait, aluminum brass. That is aluminum brass. That is. Come on, pop on aluminum, but I, I don't, I haven't seen any aluminum. Well, I'll figure that out for next time. I'll real quick do this. This increases how much stuff there can be inside it at any one time. So now there's eight slots because there's eight empty spaces inside. So yes, I will put this in here like so, yes. So with this we can uh, melt down ores and get double ores. And we can make tools. Special tools with all these components and crafting and stuff. So yeah, we probably want to make a better pickaxe than this one. But we'll, we'll have uh, a look at that. At the next episode. Also, between episodes, I'll probably clean this up a bit and make a uh, a food farm, like some plants and stuff, with some of all this stuff I have in here. Cause, oh boy, look at my hunger. It's just it's it's a mess. I, I want to fix that, so I'll make a bucket if possible. I'll figure it out. But yeah. So. That was it for this time. Like, favorite, and subscribe for more videos. And remember, what you demand, I shall serve. Bye!